Let's play Switch. Switch is kind of like a polarity type game. I think that's what that's called. And this is the new, brand new fancy face version that has Facebook integration features, which I'm not going to be using. Partially to not show you my Facebook, but also because, well, <clears throat> that was a useful tutorial. Um, I lost my train of thought. Um, <clears throat> These are really helpful. Anyway. Oh, holy crap, these are huge. Okay, the tutorial levels you can just skip, I guess. So yeah, you want to be the same color as the stuff- Hey! Jerk face. You want to be the same color as the balls that you want to collect. You collect them, you win. Anyway, I'm not big on the Facebook, on the social gaming aspect of some stuff. You know, if I want to socially game something, I'll, like, play it with a friend in person, but, or online. But I'm not one for the posting scores and stuff, which is sort of, not ironic, but, I don't know what you'd call it, but I'm actually planning a game that may have some social slash Facebook type features at the moment to develop, but... I'm planning to do it on Android, actually. It's sort of a business sim type game, but ow. Anyway, yeah, if you notice, you touch the wrong ball color, you lose all of your balls. My balls, no! So I'm masculating. And if, you probably haven't noticed yet, but... As time goes on, the... Arena around the balls here... Gets slowly smaller. Um, very slowly at first, it's more pronounced in later levels. It's sort of an interesting way to add some urgency into the game. Ow. It's sort of a time limit. I I at least assume at a certain point that t the time is just over, but I haven't seen that happen yet. And it's sort of confusing at first because I thought... Oh, hey, you shouldn't go beyond these boundaries, because they're boundaries, and that's how boundaries work. But no, it's only for the, the balls, you see. And this one is obviously a lot quicker than the others. Let's see if it gives us a game over or something. Oh, I get it. If these touch, if the, the lines here touch, it probably gets a game over. It's sort of a very interesting way to go about doing that, I guess. That's fairly intuitive. At least once I realized this was a timer thing, and then I saw these, I kind of assumed those touch game over time. Either that or it'd be very hard to outplay. I'm not entirely sure what happens when I... Do I lose some points? No, you don't lose points when you touch uh, the wrong color, but you do... You're gonna lose your combo, and you're gonna... You lose your balls, of course. Wee. That looks like a frickin' octopus. Ah! No! Game over! What? Apparently you can get a game over. Uh, restart last level. But... Do I have health somehow? How did I get a game over? I know I bumped into the wrong color a couple of times, but I didn't see any indication of health. Are those stars my health? Do I have three health now? I don't know. Come here. It's a- ow. Okay, the stars are my health. It probably told me in the tutorial. I just was paying no attention. The tutorial is too easy, by the way. You know, I won the first two levels the instant the game started. That's just a bit too easy. In my opinion, anyway. And wow, the score gets really high really quick. Where did that 9 come from? Wee. Okay, sometimes you're gonna just going to have to give up the combo. I hate giving up the combo, though. That, ow, I fail. 
Oh, and I keep not going outside the boundaries. Well, it's a very powerful psychological force, apparently. And I like that it grows, like, organically, like, wherever they make the balls make contact, you grow in that direction. A little kind of like a candelabra. Come here. Okay, we gotta not get a game over here. Ah! No! Okay, they, they keep their color, that... Crap. Well, that didn't help me very much, but... It's nice that the balls you lose keep color. Huh, enter code. Yeah, I didn't think so. I guess it's a, one of those password system things, basically. Which I really hate, by the way, but it's better than nothing. And presumably it does save your progress normally, too, so I guess that's fine. I just have horrific memories of, you know, back when Mega Man... The only way to... I suck. Anyway, there's also... There's endurance mode and open play mode. I'm not... Honestly sure what those do. Let's see what this... Oh. Graphics on high. Yeah, that looks... Exactly the same. Let's-a go. Ow. Doing the levels as sets is... Kind of an interesting thing, but... Not sure I get the point of it, really. Because you can just continue to the last level. Ow. I am terrible. And yeah, I won't be playing this the whole game. Because, you know, it doesn't change too much. But it's fairly fun. Spider. I'm like a spider dude. A white spider dude. Spider dude. Spider dude. Dude dude. Okay, let's, I'm, I'm beating this level. I don't care how many of these game overs I'm going to get. I will finish a simple game for once in my life. Rawr. You are mine. Ha. I will collect all of the balls. Then I will use them as the power source for my plans or something. I don't know. This game does not have a story, of course. Oh, hey, it's the spiky dude. Hey, spiky dude. You're not good for my health. You are spiky. Spiky things are generally not good. Not in video games, anyway. Unless you're the spiky thing. You might be a protagonist with a spiky hair and a dark past, like in every anime ever and every Final Fantasy ever. I guess the two are vaguely similar. So, I don't think I'm supposed to do anything about that guy. I just ignore him, right? I don't think there's any sort of kill button. But when I bumped into him before, he spat out a star. Does that always happen? Because that seems very weird. I'm going to be a retard to hit him anyway. Hey! What? What just happened? I... I don't know what just happened here. A new gameplay mechanic has been introduced, so that's... Ow, I fail. So that's good, but... I don't understand it, so that's bad. The gameplay mechanic has also cursed. That's bad. Can I go now? Stupid balls, stop not collecting. Ah! Nose! Well, let's just gather all the black... Oh! Hey, I'm not so bad. I wonder if... Does it say, hey, you're really bad if you die with a really low score? I'm going to check that out. Ready? No, I'm not ready. I'm going to die a lot. Ah, I'm dying a lot. Apparently you can't... Hey, I am so bad. You're lying. You freaking lying liar face. You are a liar face. 
By the way, this game is made and copyrighted by Action Sprite. 2008, apparently, even though it, the Facebook integrated version just came out. But, yeah, if you like... Oh, hey, there's a spiky dude on here. I'm not sure what that caught me. caught my attention. Anyway, you should... You can play this game if you want to. Hey, spiky dude! You suck. No one likes spiky dudes. They are brooding. And protagonists. Which I guess people like. Anyway, this has been Switch FB. And it is on new grounds. It's oddly addicting for a very simple concept and weird little game, I guess. I suck at this game, though, so I'm not going to be playing anymore. Bye!